<laughs> Good morning, everybody. We gotta put gas in the Honda this morning. to pick up our load. It is. It's it's still cold out here. It warmed up a little bit. Not near as cold as yesterday, but it's cold. Yeah, sweet tea. You got sweet tea? Mm -hmm. That'll work. work. Okay. Well, we're gonna get all you can eat spaghetti. What we're gonna get. Right there. That's what it looks like. May only be able to eat one plate, but still to say, if you're still hungry, you get more, right? They got some good stuff though. Taco salad. That's meatloaf.
See that? That's my salad. There it is, guys. There's my spaghetti. It's all you can eat. See that? And you get your garlic toast, too. Yes, we're gonna eat, and we'll be right back. That's an empty plate. That's an empty plate. My salad is empty. I'm stuffed. Now it's time to go to work. We gotta wash out our wagon and then go uh, to Sap Brothers. We gotta fuel up our wagon. Then we're on our way to uh, Crete. So we'll be right back. All right. Oh, shoot. I guess I better get over there because there's already another truck over there. I didn't realize there was somebody else waiting. I better get in line, right? I just gotta get, get a trailer wash out. Rudy said the same thing happens to his truck. It's like my truck is frozen down, but it's not. I guess it's something to do with the brakes. We're gonna go over here though and get in line. I guess that's what we're gonna have to do. trailer washed out we got our fuel trailer got fuel let's go to Crete Nebraska we got and we're gonna drop our wagon off then end up going to the Walmart sitting waiting until they say my trailer is loaded and guess where we're going with this load should I tell you We are going to Memphis, Tennessee. Yeah. The trailer doesn't get loaded till tomorrow, but if I get my trailer over there and dropped, it can get it, it can get loaded as early as 2 a.m. tomorrow morning. So that's why we gotta get over there now and drop this wagon. And there is a Walmart over there, so I'm gonna grab me a little bit of food for my truck. And uh, that way I can keep on eating out of my truck. They need a light here. They really do. Cause there ain't no light. <laughs> All right, well let's head on over to Crete, Nebraska. We'll be right back. Left curve ahead. We are coming into Crete, Nebraska. Right up here to the left is a Walmart. And that's where we're gonna come back to when we uh, get our trailer over there and drop it. That is one Walmart, they don't care if you park it. Turn right on 13th Street, ME 103. I just hope nobody ever messes that up because if somebody ever does, then we'll have to go all the way back to Lincoln to park. But we're actually allowed to park here. As far as I know, we're still able to. It's been a while since I've been here. But I did see a couple trucks in there. Oh, 
what it would take is uh, a truck driver to be throwing his trash out or his piss bottles. Just anything that's going to give Walmart more work to do. And especially picking up piss bottles, that's a biohazard, right? So when we get back over there, we'll see if we can still park there. See if anybody ever messed it up. Not too long from now, it's going to be dark. I'm yawning, I know. I'm not tired, I'm just yawning. make a phone call guys I just discovered something used to be a burrito truck that sat in that parking lot back there and you can you know if you bob tail and whatever you did park on the side you run telling you want a burrito I just found him he's got a store now he's not working out of an RV anymore I gotta let somebody know that U-turn. He 
doesn't know what he wants to do. I know I gotta get ready to put my coat on though. Walmart. 